YouTube, what is good? We are back. It is Tuesday and we have quite the nice looking batch of orders, I must say. We'll start off at the top. We got this great ones row. A lot of ones in this row right here. Haven't been selling for us. The Volt ones really never sell. Biohacks, I feel like I just spoke about that. Royal Toes, similar. And speaking of doesn't sell slash just not a lot available, we got the top three one right here. Brand new 11 and a half my size. These bad boys sold for $8.50. Buy it now. Definitely proud of that. It was a listing that was up there for probably years shout out to whoever hit the buy it now button there greatly appreciate it we got a brand new concord next to the brand new red cements the red cements i feel like are you know steadily creeping up in price i could be crazy to think that but pretty sure they are we got a seven and a half white cement three that we sold via dm shout out to jp from florida for hitting us up for the brand new seven and a half we got a used 10 going out as well we got a big 14 used women's 12 and a half men silver toe brand new yellow toe we got brand new cherries brand new playoff size 15 we got this social status pennies it's funny my boy was texting me about those saying he's gonna come in and try them on and literally like half hour later they ended up selling i feel like we were just talking about our ds weatherman so it's hilarious that like the next day or the next couple days the used weatherman sells brand new reverse grinch next to a used kobe we got these i don't even know what they are converse pleasures something that was sitting next to these what are those with no laces don't even ask how we acquired those things uh, we got some blazers supreme ld waffles nice new balance next to the shack gnosis which i feel like just popped up on my feed obviously in men in black will smith wore those i don't know why they popped up on my feed but the other day they did we got the curry dunk gotta talk about those because that was a 400 to 500 sneaker great quality and now they're like what 100 to 200 depending on the size it just goes to show you i feel like sometimes people only want what they can't acquire or what a lot of people can't get and then once it's you know fully obtainable for the regular human being i feel like a lot of people just feel like it's not as good as a shoe which is crazy because it's still a great pair but I've, I've seen that happen on a lot of pairs so that's kind of crazy to see vegas nice falcons eagles shirt sanders and i gotta talk about this nick Foles jersey because i put it up for 500 or something like that and i got a lot of hate messages on ebay like oh i think you added a zero i'll give you a hundred that's crazy and it ended up selling for 500 sometimes you got to know how rare your stuff is this is a nick Foles authentic just really never see these you don't even see anyone with one listed so that's really cool the chaos kobe's i feel like I might have forgotten about talking about those and then we got this fire starter sun's jacket half zip classic definitely nice to see that go out and we got a couple other things to find but that's what we'll start off the day with guys anything about the orders or anything else first i want to go to not not a shoe but kind of what ace folding right now the nick Foles jersey for me one of my favorite things to learn is jerseys in here you know shoes it's not easy but it's kind of like something that's kind of repetitive jerseys it's really different and it's something that you know you really gotta have a passion for and know so i like learning about like jerseys whenever they come in especially like a Nick Foles, just a guy who came in and, you know, won a Super Bowl. And I remember that Super Bowl run, and I know what that Super Bowl means for, like, a lot of people who are Eagle fans and people who are from Philadelphia or in the area. So that's a beautiful piece right there. Just looking at it, it's authentic. The way it's just made from a regular Nike jersey, it's, like, totally different. So that's a beautiful piece. Then right next to that, you got a Deion Sanders jersey. You know, hate the Cowboys, but honestly, like, Deion Sanders Cowboys jersey is such a staple piece, in my opinion. If you go online and you look for his jersey, that's the most sought-after ones you see popping up all over eBay or anywhere else so two really beautiful jerseys the kids Tasmanian vintage t-shirt really fire you know me I love a good hockey jersey so the Vegas Golden Knights I believe they won the Stanley Cup last year so really nice jersey Shaq Gnosis those are really fire just a beautiful beautiful Reebok shoe right there next to the old school Curry's size 15 playoff 13s love seeing the variety and being able to have everything for everyone and then you got a bunch of just like Curry's Pata and uh, Monarchs the Kobe 6 Chaos like those are just fire I know Ace spoke about the very dumb. I just want to talk about those real fast because when Burr and I was walking around one nigga show, we picked up a pair and I remember we sold them for a pretty good price and like right after that they kind of like dipped again in price so it's kind of crazy to see just stuff like that. Carhartt New Balance, one of my two favorite brands. So to see a collab like that is just really beautiful. The Kobe ADs, I remember before the Kobe 6s and the 5s were going crazy. The Kobe AD was one of the most popular ones that you've seen guys like AD, Devin Booker, DeMar DeRozan, all those guys were wearing those. So really fire. Kobe right there. Three reimagined 
reasons. You know how we feel about those. And then I know Berman's probably gonna talk about those unions. I just wanna point those out real fast just to see where they're at right now. Super cheap. But again, that's such a beautiful sneaker. I just think the attention and detail on that shoe is really nice. The box is beautiful. Just everything about that shoe is just really, really nice. So shout out to everyone who purchased something over the weekend. It's good morning. Finally, nice weather out. It looks like it's, you know, finally turning warmer for good. We hope. Never know when a snowstorm might hit us again, but it's nice to be able to walk outside and be comfortable. A lot of variety here, as always. I was gonna point out the curry dunks, but the guys have done a really good job talking about those. Kind of crazy, I had to do my, uh, I had to go back and check to make sure I was seeing it correctly, but it was like, you know, like a little over a year ago that those, those were hitting like 400-ish. Kind of crazy to think about how those dropped in price, but uh, you know, it shows people want, you know, they want what they want. Speaking of people wanting what they want, like Aaron pointed out, those top threes, that's a pretty crazy sale. Nice to see though that some of these older ones, especially brand new, you know, continue to hold their value. Sometimes it's nice to just get a sale like that and really boost, boost your mood a little, especially when dealing with a lot of these, you know, different eBay uh, customer service situations. But on the contrary to that, if you go over to the uh, the yellow toes or the taxis, um, I think that's a pretty crazy example of just a sign of the times. You know, if that shoe had been released along with like the OG pine green ones or the core purples, you know, it's similar color blocking. It's just like the yellow that I feel like people always asked about. Other than that, I mean, I think we covered a lot. We're looking forward to today and uh, we'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm gonna start with the union ones, um, just cause like Jordan pointed out, those are going for a pretty low price and the quality, the craftsmanship is just great. I actually been thinking about grabbing another pair just cause I'm ready to beat my other pair down. We already know what we do with reimagines, red cements, and the Kobe reverse Grinches. One of our best sellers as far as the eBay goes as of recently. I always say it every video, but I love seeing new and used reimagined threes go out. Definitely a great model right there. A Shaq Gnosis, one of my favorite 90s basketball shoes. Curry Dunks, it's funny, I remember back at the old store we used to sell those for about four to five hundred and it's crazy to see those go for a hundred i remember looking at the sold this morning and i was like ain't no way those actually sold for that price and like a said those are a great dunk like the quality and the little suede on that it's really great like the eagles vintage all over print tee love me a good taz vintage tee i feel like one of those are one of the best prints phoenix suns jacket absolutely fire love 90 starter jackets just because of how chunky they look and i'm gonna end off with those hideous converses as you guys can see got all the variety here here. We pride ourselves on that. From Reeboks to Curry's. Then over here, random Converse's. So shout out to whoever bought those. Not gonna lie, when I was taking pictures of those, I was wondering if they came with laces. And then when I looked them up, they actually don't. Really? Yeah, they don't. Wow. So I didn't know that. That's kind of funny. Shut up the prices. <laughs> <laughs> I, I believe it's a slip-on shoe, so that's kind of why they don't come with laces. But that's uh, kind of weird. But uh, yeah, shout out to whoever bought that. Okay, we gotta pack up all this stuff. I gotta go find some more stuff. So let's see what happens today. Check that out. What was the bet? What was the bet we made? <laughs> Shit, I, I don't even remember to be honest with you, bro. I don't remember either. I kind of forgot about it until, until just now. I forgot. What was the bet? Should we go around a hundred? Um, I know. I know. It was, I said we're going to Eastern Conference Finals, though. I said that. Next going to Eastern Conference Finals. Was that the bet? Yeah. You said no. <laughs> but now you probably second guessing that shit. Oh yeah, cause I, cause I, I mean, I, I mean, I took it back. I'm not, I'm not gonna go back on it, but yeah. I was after it. I was, nah, I was way before the, the OG, the OG trade. Facts, before right. OG, no. Before OG, hell fucking no. With OG, yeah. But we was looking good before that, though. To be honest, not Eastern Conference. That's what I think. I don't know. I could be wrong because I think the playoffs gonna be crazy. But that's just my opinion. I think this is the year we come out, bro. Health is a question mark. That's 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 the that's the key right there. It's like the Clippers. Like the Clippers, if they're not healthy, they're not going anywhere. That's a fact. And that's a, that's another team who's inconsistent right now. Like that's a fact. technically, I have them coming out the West. What you looking for this stuff? Honestly, bro, I was trying to three for one this shit. To be honest, maybe add a little cash. Three for one might be tough. I, I forgot what I told you last time on these, but I know these are low. Nah, these these are low. The These go for a little bit of cheese. That was a good look up. Okay. Well, we'll see. We got them. What you value these, like, number wise? What was the value? Store credit? Yeah, like, what the number come up to? I would say, like, 60, 50, 60, 50 store credit. Okay, 50, 60 here. These, like, 50. And then these, like, 80, 70, something like that. Would you want for these Kobe's again? Like store credit, like I would be at like sixty, seventy, maybe. For these? Yeah. So I was at like a buck for the three, so it's like 30, 30, 40. Um, I could drop those to two. Two. 
and a hundred will be the difference. Mm. I will be a little bit more, but nah, yeah, the inside. I hope that I'm just gonna lie. <laughs> and there's like a, there's like a clean pair that I sold for for a buck online. Oh yeah, and it had the extra laces. Oh, look, can you do eighty? Uh, let me see. You gonna bring those back? Nah, I'm keeping these. Bro. You gonna bring those back, bro? These is these is one of them ones right here. I do 90. 90? Mm hmm. So then 90, 80 coin flip, bro. <laughs> I got you 90. They two on they two on top. Alright, what about 85? 85, bro. 90, 90s. Well, you, you already said you need them. I'm trying to I might have to run that though. Because I'm going to get the 100 back on the back end from you. <laughs> on the east end. You don't see? That back, bro. We gonna see. You better hope your boys come back healthy. That's all I'm saying. Nah, we good, bro. I'm tripping. I'm straight. You sure about that? Positive, bro. Mm -hmm. Transfer. I like. I like the confidence. Alright, bet. I'm, I'm running right now. Why are you running? Uh, card. Yeah. It don't matter, bro. I mean, that does matter. It's a lot, bro. It's a lot of people that have been in the league and they hit 40k, bro. I'm saying. Five in the league. I think the longest out of everything. It is already 111 and the day has already started. As you can see, we got a lot of older SBs and stuff like that here. A lot of this stuff is just really hard to move again. It's a lot of older stuff, but it's cool stuff. But for us, we don't really move this type of stuff that well. More of a Jordan kind of store. That's what we know. That's our bread and butter. But we're gonna start off here with the Dr. Seuss. These are really fire. I really like these. I like the quality on them. Really, really nice. Everything here is size 12. Besides these, De La Souls, white pair, super, super rare. Don't see them that often. We have the high the 10 I believe these are used but stupid rare shoe right here this one's beautiful you know the brown one's been popping up a lot lately within like the last couple years so this one's really nice really dope shoe to add to the case in here so all the other SPs that we that we have so these are really fire some orcas not much to say about him it's a white and black sneaker white and black dunk to be specific I believe these were called the uh when I looked them up they were called the homers color blocking is cool just a weird sneaker just weird dunk high funky sneaker definitely dope definitely speaks to the error that the shoe was released in lightly 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 used statue of liberties super rare talking about this shoe with with a off camera but how like just rare this shoe is beautiful beautiful piece right here you know come with the green laces and some syracuse the latest pair i think he bought these in 2020 what do you pay he paid the high for them at the time pay about 550 this shoe is like 253 now depending on the size so really good shoe and we made a deal off camera about these after talking to a negotiating um with a gentleman super rare pair Busan. and then the other one says so really fire has some yellowing definitely a dope sneaker that you know we're going to display next door it's going to look really dope in the case so so we got going on did another deal earlier for some red foam shout to that dude he's a big knicks fan we made i think we made a bet for the knicks trade i said the knicks weren't going to the eastern conference he said they were with that trade that deal is looking very very strong on his side right now but we'll see a lot of those guys are not healthy so we visit this back in april how you doing chilling bro how are you last time i saw you had glasses though yeah yeah facts yeah. facts facts how you doing? Chilling, bro. Just got some shit. See if y'all want. And you just trying to sell today? Yeah. Y'all right, take no box? Yeah. Take clothes, Central. Uh, Centrals and stuff like that. Nah. Okay. I don't know. Take no box for these. I don't know if you're taking these. Okay. What are you asking on this stuff? So, um, these I'll be interested in, these I'll be interested in. These, yeah, which one is interested in? Um, these four, maybe, depending on the price. Um, white shell toes I'll pass on. Uh, so I always pass on these, I can look them up, but I might pass on these. Uh, 
really trying to get rid of those, bro. <laughs> you really trying to get rid of these? <laughs> oh yeah, I've been trying to get rid of them for a minute. Like, yeah, bro, I'll buy those out. Um, I might be interested in these. Get, these these were the like the brand on price will determine how interested I am on these. What you think about for those? Like, what you say for those? Let me see what they're going for. What's your number on these two? The the Callies and the um the Bat Bunnies. I know they low, bro. 150, 150, bro. Let me see. And I'm coming out here from Staten Island too. You know that. <laughs> Let me see. You said 150 on the um Callies. Yeah. Okay. What about um these eights? These are new, right? Uh, nah, he's slightly worn, bro. Slightly worn. Yeah, yeah, bro. He clean. He's super clean. What you asking on these? I want to like two. Let's see if That's I get two. Mark out for those, but size good too. Good size, but we can work. Two might be tough because I see they're going for less than that. Mm. Um, but like I said, I can give you my numbers, you know, see what you want to do with that, but the uh, alternate grapes. Two? These are called Georgetown's. Uh, two, when I was looking for two, and I, it's a little, it's clean, it's just like a... Like I wore one time, it's like if you go a little, you know what I'm saying? Mm. They clean the stars. This is my token. The Kiss Sambas, how much? Oh, I pay fucking retail for those. If I could get retail or somewhere near there, that's cool. I'll take a couple of dollars loss. What's retail on? I pay 140 no, oh, stuff. Yeah. These I'll probably pass on because I, I guess they restocked this year. So yeah, I'll pass on those. That's okay. what they're going for. Yeah. Um, the, the Valentine's Day Dunks? Uh, 120. And um, what about these guys? Hello. Um, so these I'll probably pass on as well. No so my numbers were uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, probably pass on these four right here. No um, my numbers were 530. Um, I could kind of give you a breakdown on where I was at for most of this stuff. So you pass on this, pass on these? Yeah, the two no box and these two Adidas. I'll pass on everything else was 530. I'll give you something You sure? Alright, bet. Appreciate it, man. Uh, so yeah, these two are out the picture. Yeah. So it's this stuff right here. Yeah, so I was at 530 here. Look, look at it, think about it. Right, what, what was the numbers? How did you do um, it? was like 70, a buck, a buck. I think it was like a buck here, like 60, 70. On these two, these are super low. The eights and the um, the alternate grapes aren't that high from what I was looking at. That was at 5.30 for everything. You said how much was it? 70. They're like 110. And how much you got bucked for these two? Uh, buck, buck, buck. And like 77, let me just double check the... I'm gonna take these back. What, what was the lowest you're doing those? I know. I, I know I'm gonna get another offer for these because these just gonna go up. I don't know why everybody went to Georgetown's now. Yeah. I know I'm gonna get these for I'll be 430. You can do 500 right there. Just 500 straight. I don't wanna come up with nothing. Alright, 500. Well, I know these ain't money like this, but I know you're gonna get these off right here for a good price. Both of those for a fact. Cause they clean, bro. I can do 450. 480? Probably 450, man. Yeah, let me get that fucking. What's the loss you're doing in Georgetown? I know you said you're a keeper, but just. No, I know. Nah, the two, I'm definitely going to be able to get two off of those, bro. I'm just going to clean them up nice and definitely. Fine. All right. Um, what's the best way for you? How we pay you last time? Oh, um, I pay me cash. Cash. You got Apple Pay? I'm going to say, can we Apple Pay you? Absolutely, I'll take Apple Pay. All right, bet, bet. I'll take that, bro. Of course, I can just swap for everything, but I don't know. I haven't really looked at the values on some of them. Like, I know. I tried looking for the box for those. I couldn't find them. These are new or try it on? Or try, try it on. I just never. Pretty, pretty clean. Yeah. 
Those tried on and I just never wore them. Uh, those I had. I honestly don't remember. It's a question. I know how much these go for. I know how much these go for. Those. So you basically like valued everything around five? Yeah. I mean, I could be wrong. Uh, the only ones I didn't really look up were. I know the, they're called um, Spectrums, I think. Gotcha. That one, I'm not, I'm not too sure how much it goes for. That or the Golden uh, Rods Dunks. I just figured it would be like 80, could be wrong. Like 80 each? Hmm? Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, 80 for the, the, the Dunks. That, yeah. that I'm assuming is like 40. Yeah, wrong box. Oh, okay, gotcha. Don't you want to keep this box? It might be. Oh, it's the wrong box? Yeah, it might be to which you have. No. Um, I like 120 to the three. Got you. For those three. These are new with no box or? No, they're, they're used. They're used just yeah. correctly. Could you, could you add like 70? Yeah, yeah that's fine. Is that cool? I was at, uh, we're at 430. Um, it would have been more of the correct boxes, right? Or something. Maybe a little, yeah. I just, like, I don't know. These, these type of shoes just don't really do well. The highs. Um, Obviously, the better pairs are probably these two. Yeah. The other stuff isn't really too good. That's fine, yeah. That's yeah, if that works. I'm fine with seven. What box is this from, anyways? Uh, I got multiple yeah. boxes in my house. Uh, what's the best way? Uh, if we could do a card. Okay. Card just tap. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Much appreciate, thank you, man. No problem, bro. Have a good one. You too. Be thank safe. You. We're back. Not sure how much content we got today. We got a lot of work done. We still got a lot of work to do. Shouts to all y'all watching the content, buying stuff on eBay, making offers, DMing us, supporting us. Greatly appreciate it. As you can see, we got a crazy array of shoes right here. Got a lot of SBs coming in. Dr. Seuss, Hawaii, Crown Royal, Dunk Low Portugal's right there. Off White 90, Off White Dunk, Off White 90. We got some red cements used. Off white Air Force. Keep these Reebok above the rim joints. I could say they're new, but we're not going to say that. They are used. Oh man, we got a Travis Scott low in there peaking. The N7 Jordan 8. Crazy, crazy batch of stuff. Black Cats. I know that's like a fan favorite. We could pant over here. We got some stuff on the floor that we have to go through. We got this interesting pair, which uh, I haven't seen yet. The Air Jordan 1 low 85. As you can see, we got this retro style box right there. There. And then we got the shoe. You know, if you like Jordan 1 Lowe's, I think that's definitely a cool one. Wow, that actually feels a little more, there's a little more play in there than the regular like 85 highs. You guys know what I'm saying. Speaking about know what I'm saying, the Brazil dunks came back. That's crazy because if you guys remember that dunk used to be at least 350 and now they're back to around 120 bucks. That's about it. Busy day again. Shouts to all y'all. I guess we'll get the one and done so we can get out of here. All right, uh, we're getting jam-packed here. I feel like if I make this shot, it would be three one and done's main in a row. Is that correct, Brian? Yeah. All right, put myself in the pressure cooker. See you guys tomorrow. Oh. Ah, that sucked. YouTube, we're back. Rainy Day Chronicles. As you can see, we have a nice batch of orders right here. Definitely cannot complain. We got some new. We got some used. We got arguably the best women's release of all time. In my personal opinion, this is one of those sneakers that when they came back in 07, I was like, why didn't they make that a men's pair? Definitely a nice colorway. Um, if you know, you know. Mikasa Sukasa, maybe they're called. Soulfly 8. It's very nice quality materials on these. The SF on the front. Very cool. If you like 8s, what the 5s, under 4s. These right here, where will you ever see these? Derek Jeter, four, five, six, double play. Pretty sure I got these at a flea market like way back in the day. And, uh, you know, slow money is better than no money. Speaking of that, we got the Supreme Air Max 98, which I have to say is one of those sneakers I probably should have sold years ago. It's one of those pairs you say, oh, this shoe's going to be worth $1,000 one day, $800, $1,500. Definitely went down in price. We ended up selling those a little under $400 shipped. And that's kind of market on them right there. So shouts to the dude who hit us up via DM. Speaking of 
shout outs, we got the A6 Concepts. Shout out to the dude who grabbed those. He said he wanted some stickers, so we had to throw those in. We got the Sacconis right there, which sold for 60 shipped. Definitely nice value right there with the Sacconis. Two pair of foam posits going out, the anthracites and the gold. Speaking of foam posits, I see the eggplants are coming out. Might try to grab those for myself. Jubilees, Black Cements, and Rebellionaires. Three good pairs with no box. We got some awesome t-shirts going across the front. That San Antonio Spurs logo and all the old stuff they did is super fire shout out to everyone who watched the san antonio video because y'all are the bomb and then we got the bread fours going out of course one of the best if not the best release of the year so far shouts to jeff on that purchase and that's about it let's see what else we think about the orders i really love this batch honestly i feel like this to me this speaks sneaker culture i think this is like a real sneaker head batch right here of just stuff going out the reason why i say that is because you have to me one of the greatest orders of all time the black cement threes you have some foam posits to me a top three nines basketball shoe then you got your air forces right right here in the early 2000s if so that colorway dropped you know that one was doing numbers just like a nice caramel mocha brown colorway that probably would have done numbers honestly you have some 98 trainers and some Sacconis, a sick gel like five a model that was going crazy back in the 2010s those eights probably the best women's release from jordan for sure the so fly eights i think those are really really fire but i think it's a beautiful sneaker i think that's probably one of the best ones in my opinion i just feel like that's just a really nice collab i think the box is nice kind of like a cigar box so that's really fun beautiful foam posits just regular all black but you know this is the um the little bit of the older pair i think like 2017 2020 something like that no they re-released but that 240 uh, price is kind of crazy these sacconis are just so so far to me if they were a half size smaller i definitely would have cop the big sacconi logo the 3d this colorway is just fired the neon on the inside kind of a gum bottom these just really really dope so nice pair of trainers right here another shoe that takes me back this is like one of the shoes i should always come to the old store try to cop because i think a had 10 and the black pair like way way back in the day and every time i would walk into a store like i already knew the size i already knew it was too big but like for some reason i was just always hope like it was like you know like a half size smaller so this supreme collab was really fire black pair was my favorite pair but this to me is definitely this, my second favorite definitely best shoe of the year so far i don't think there's gonna be a shoe that topped this shoe this year you could argue probably the military blue forts but as of right now i think this red fort is the shoe of the year so far it's gonna be in the running for a long long time in my personal opinion two vintage shirts really like both love seeing the venture stuff goes the aop nascar t and then you get the old logo i call it like the lightning bolt san antonio spurs shirt i think they won last night so i'm not sure actually i think they lost actually you know Wemby's hot right now he's been balling probably gonna win rookie of the year so not surprised to see that um sell so shout out to everyone who cops something yeah i'm gonna start off with the eights because i really like those the side panels kind of remind me of the 90s cup that they used to like uh give out at pizzerias if i could find that picture i'll put it up right now it's like a spray type of like design on a cup and it kind of reminds me of that design panels on the eights i really like the soul flies as well like everyone said the quality and the craftsmanship of that shoe is great especially when it comes to the box i know a couple of videos ago we talked about how much stores or companies make the box look more presentable than the shoe and that's definitely one of them love these little row of no box stuff when it comes to rebellionaires threes and jubilees all pretty decent condition especially those threes very very clean love to see the trainers go out especially since the a6 and sakoni wave is still going air max 98 really like the snakes on that one that's probably my favorite colorway out the pack and the bread fours recently saw a video of people at a sneaker event wearing those with white laces matted out it seems like a lot of people are already like customizing them so that's really good to see i'm really glad i got my pair for around retail so that's really awesome like everyone's been saying that's kind of sneaker of the year right now so we'll see how the rest of the year goes so we're talking about women's sneakers this women's pair just came out which is crazy to me that uh, that's a specific women's sizing because jordan brand would have got my money on that one if they made men's sizes definitely a nice color way and yeah that's weird going on but yeah let's pack up all this stuff get it shipped out and see what happens on this rainy day how much were you looking for this stuff mm, i don't have a number just wonder anything see what you was thinking yeah i have a number of mine i'm assuming five phone posits no uh, these are g's okay any ballpark Just what you thinking? Not really sure. Probably like around like around two seventy for the five. Do three, three school. Uh, what's can the next? Get, hold on. Uh, so can I just can I get the uh, can I see the 
the, the Jordan Four Thunders. That's the uh, yellow pair, right? Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. What size? Fourteen. We can do a spot for these. These for this. Uh, yeah, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Let me just get that inventory number. Yep, yo, so you need a bag? No, I'm good. All right, bet. All right, yep, thank you. Sir. No problem, bro. Have a good one. You too. Thank you. What's up, partner? What's up, dude? How you doing? How you doing, bro? What's up, bro? How you doing? Aaron not around today? He next door. All right, brother. What's up, man? How you doing, bro? Got some little oh, things, you know? All together? This is all? Uh, no, nah, no. Nah, hold on. I'm about to separate right now. Let yeah. me yeah. check that one, bro. Sorry. I don't know if y'all buy this. Those ones, this one. This one right here, one? Yeah, yeah, this one. Little sun trying to get it Yeah, what you asking on this stuff? Um, I gotta see what's going on, bro. see what I'm measuring. I'm not even sure. That's These are able to take the grapes. The grapes? They're 10. Flat? They're 10 flat. They meant. My grandfather was a homing pigeon. My eternal hope So what are you thinking? Um, I mean for these three, probably like 180. 180 for those three, okay. If, if, if that's what y'all like going on. And what about these? Like 150. 150? Alright, let me see what I'm going to do for you. Yeah, I ain't wear these in a minute. I should have cleaned them before I put them up. No, you're good, bro. You're good. And this one you said 180? Yeah. Alright, so I was at a buck here and I was at 120 here. This stuff, these are a lot lower than I thought. And what, what, what about oh, that? Oh shit, my father got about that. Know, yeah. What'd you want for this guy? I don't know. I got gifted and I don't know about it. Let me see. But Anything? I don't wear that shit. Anything in mind? I don't know what it's at. What is it, what is it at right now? Just throw me something for it, bro. I don't even care about it. This is just shit sit around in my closet. Alright, let me see. Do like 70 on it? Uh, I'll do 70 for it. Okay. Um, you said what you was at for these three? Uh, these three, I was at 120. I was at 100 there. 100, damn. These dips. Yeah, right? They're selling for 150. I'll keep these, bro. Okay. I'd rather rock them than that. Alright. Had them for too long. All right, so this is 190 right here. All right, that's cool. That's cool. What's, yeah. what's the best way? Uh, Zelle, Apple Pay. You got Apple Pay. Apple oh, Pay. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. I just received it right now, right, brother. Bet. You know, appreciate you, you know, bro. Up, How you doing, bro? What you looking Thank for good. your stuff? I'm um, just looking for some offers. See what I can get. Anything in mind? Like these, I know I'll probably pass on. Like they're definitely uh, dope, but the new ones are out. The ones are out, yeah. And these are starting to go. They are wearable, I'll tell you that, I'll be... Yeah, they seem to tell right here. It's already gone, so... These are probably definitely hard, I kept the five. Definitely. Let me see. Oh, yeah. What All do you right. want for these and the core purples? The core um, purples, I gotta check the market. I gotta see what they're at. Okay. I haven't, I haven't looked at that shit so long. Them? One thirty. So anyway, we do like at least like... One seventy on these? On those? Five, yeah. Okay, Let's and see. what about these? Like, one fifty? One fifty. I mean, what's the market? I really don't know what's the market on these. I did spend like 400 yeah, like, you got two years from, ago. I was gonna say you got it from Go, right? From Go, and then the remasters came out, and I know they just dropped. Okay. I really don't know the price on these now. I don't. I want to get paid really. attention to that. <laughs> we just buy them. Yeah. Let me see what to do for you. Let me see what market is roughly around. Around dog. Uh, so on these, I wouldn't be that high. I'd probably be like around 70 for these. And then these, I'll probably be a little bit lower. I'll probably be around like a buck for them, just for what I'm seeing them sell for, especially with no box. They're selling for around like the 180 ish mark. 180 ish? That's what they're selling for. Yeah, no one really wants the 2013 period. That's the problem. Plus, they dropped the loss of pounds. This is like the least desirable Chicago out of all the ones they've ever dropped. That's like, it makes yeah. it harder because no one likes no one likes the, um, the, the big tongue and everyone hates to, to jump in on the back. Okay. So I'm afraid I can do more, obviously, but... Um, can we do 200 for both pairs? 200 for both? You think it could be yours? I don't care about them. I know I did spend like fucking hella bread on them. Nah, I hear you, I hear you. Like that market shit, yeah, I know. <laughs> Just like to buy Yeezys. Um, it'll work. 
Yeah. I'll take the chance at two. Thank uh, you. I appreciate it. What's the best way for you? Venmo, Zell? I'll take Zell. Oh, Zell? All right, good. Mm -hmm. To say today, it was, you know, rainy day. Got a lot of work done. I feel like I've been doing drafts all day, working on content all day. Shouts to all y'all for the support. Jordan Burrow, anything for the people, one and done, all that good stuff. Probably happy we caught up to listings and taking pictures, honestly. So to have space back here. Feels good. Next task is kind of top. Try to get all that stuff done by tomorrow and try to get the clothing done by the end of the week. So, yeah, got a lot of stuff scheduled for the week, but overall, good day. Gloomy day, but good day. Yeah, shout out to everyone who's been stopping by. Like Jordan said, I've finally caught up with listings and pictures. Oh, wow, that was funny. I caught that right on camera. But as you guys can see, we have a mountain of shoes that have to go on the shelves. And I'm looking forward to these selling, honestly, because we have a lot of variety, a lot of shoes, a lot of different brands, a lot of different models. So, it's going to be exciting to put up. Don't forget topshelfkicks.com. We have the offer button right there so you don't have to go through the hassle of asking us what the lowest or highest we would take. Just hit that offer button. And if you want to avoid all the eBay fees and stuff like that, just hit us up directly on Instagram or give us a call through the store. Like Berwin said, real quick, reiterate the offer button. Use it, please. A lot of people message and say, what's the lowest you do? All that stuff. That's what the offer button's there for. Make an offer. We can go from there. Yeah, just use the offer button. Thank you, guys. Topshopkids.com. One and done. Don't mind the stuff everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> in the, we're in the process of organizing it, but here we go, one and done. Catch y'all, catch y'all Friday. Peace. I believe I can fly. I believe I can we're back and as you can see we got a nice batch of orders right here starting off at the top travis scott olive that's definitely a good one that we don't sell too often because we don't get too many often gorge greens another one name old story ones aren't going from as much as they used to go for we got these jordan two lows we got these unc fives we spoke about how unc fives usually sell well for us speaking of sell well for us these don't sell well for us so if you got the liberty tens uh, try to sell them on your own before you bring them in shout out to whoever bought these i think they sold for 75 bucks we got the grinch kobe rage edition something you don't see too often glad these are going out pretty quickly we got the flu games another shoe classic don't see too often n7 jordan 8 check the apps on that one brand new pretty high two classic 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 can i say classic one more time retro colorways and silhouettes two great shoes glad that they can sell for what they're selling for which is not as high as they should be going for we got the fighter jets i was outside for those in the cold waiting for a raffle ticket to walk inside the mall paying my my friends money to come with me so I can get extra pairs have extra bodies there in line then we'd run through the mall trying to double back in line we'd switch our hoodies trying to get another pair and hope that we weren't recognized those type of times right there and as you can see these are brand new with the OG hang tag dog tag up tempos literally walking through the shelves yesterday and I looked at that shoe and I was like man like who's gonna buy those honestly and then someone bought them so again a rare shoe right there glad to see it going out who's gonna buy those Powerpuff Girls, that's a shoe everyone wants to buy, especially for a good price. But uh, we don't get many, so when we get them in, we have to price them pretty high. Glad they're going out. I was going to say Adidas, but A6 Nimbus, I think they're called. Not really too familiar with those. We got some New Bounce, some Wave Runners. We got the classic pro models that honestly looks pretty. I mean, like, I would never do it, but, you know, the fit with the Jordan jersey and the pro models with the red stripes. I mean, Jordan, you know, did wear Adidas before, I believe, so pretty interesting stuff. Interesting stuff. Travis Scott Air Forces. Crazy that we sell a dime. Diamondbacks jersey and a fire Diamondbacks t-shirt in the same day. I mean, can't script that stuff. Speaking of script that stuff, we got the Mitchell and Ness Authentic 325 Retail Classic. Uh, what year is this one? I think this is close to the rookie edition. So to the 91-92 with the uh, black stripe right there. I think this is the, uh, is it the Shrug jersey? No, that one might be white. Um, I don't know. Either way, 325 Retail. We're selling it for a lot less than that. That's happening with a lot of Mitchell and Ness stuff. Just not commanding the prices that it used to command. I got a lot of other things to go find guys anything about the orders two shoes just they got to me from like a certain era the statue of liberties and, and, the, and the fighter jets the statue of liberties i just know like tens were a big deal back in the day and I remember seeing like a lot of people with those they weren't going for nothing crazy but again it was a good 10 still is a good 10 to have a 10's not 
again to do. Again, a really comfortable model that you can't go wrong in. Then the fight adjusters, the fight adjusters were just like during that time of the phone posits ever, and we started doing different crazy colorways and stuff like that. That was one of the crazy colorways or styles you can say that a lot of people were going crazy for. I still remember seeing people in high school and just people that I knew with those and like how much of a big deal that shoe really was. You never go wrong with a good camo. That, that little hit of red is just really, really fire in my opinion. Two shoes that we just put on the shelf, these Air Max 1s and the uh, N712s. Kind of happy about that because when I was redoing the shelf yesterday, I was just like, damn, like, I don't know if some of these are going to sell just because, you know, those N7s are just a little crazy and it's just like what they were going for. I was kind of shocked to see the pro models. Bert Irwin put out the PBA the other day. I'm so happy to see another one go. A very, very 2000 sneaker. Just really looking at that one. The red pair is pretty dope in my opinion. Crash Scott Air Force. Cool looking sneaker. But for us, it's always been a hard one to sell. I honestly didn't even know we had one. I hate the zipper in the front. I think it really ruins the sneaker. But without it, I think it's a pretty good looking shoe. Fire Red 5 is a shoe that doesn't get enough justice either. It's a shoe that people don't really respect. And the vintage stuff here. The Randy Johnson. Really beautiful t-shirt. Right next to the Diamondbacks like Ace said. And we got two Kobe's going out. The Kobe 80 NXT. And then the Kobe Mamba Rage. And the, um, the Grinch colorway. So really, really fire. And then I cannot talk about this stuff while talking about the flu games and the way runners because flu games is a beautiful sneaker a beautiful 12 might be the best 12 for sure this beautiful sneaker and in the way runner to me not a big adidas guy but i do think that's the best i was never a big fan of the nike Yeezys. i think they're really cool but to me the adidas one just really speaks to me a little bit more yeah i'm gonna start with the flu games because like jordan said that's a great jordan 12s definitely a classic definitely goes well with the jordan jersey right there the unc 5s definitely have been one of our best colorways to sell as far as the jordan 5 models so shout out to everybody about that love to see all of Travs go out I believe we're running out of Travs actually so it's a great thing to see um like the guy has been saying i feel like the fire red fires don't get enough love especially with the midnight sixes classic colorways like a said earlier shout out to whoever bought the up tempo because those are my uh high school colors quick little story about the travis scott air force i remember during covid and when i was still a customer at the store i think i wanted to buy a ds pair of those so i worked out a trade through a via dm put up to the shop luckily he was still open worked out a great trade so shout out to a for working out the trade back when covid was crazy cool memory to have with those <laughs> I want to know about um, if you can size swap these. Okay, these new use? There's no. Okay, what size do you need? I need a 12 you if need you need have them. Okay. No, no, I just, I just saw them. Mm -hmm. I, yeah. can't, I can't do nothing with a 13. Okay, so you want to size swap these. Mm. And what about everything else? You want everything you? else? Yeah, just have everything. Um, I don't know about these, I don't know if they're true. No about idea about this show. Okay. This shoe right here. It's a crazy market for them there up and down. All the kit, the um, pearls? Yeah. They use. It's funny because like, the high you give the KD models, it's like the rare the um pearls are. I have no idea. I checked on eBay like I barely in the size 12, yeah. no more, like, you know, they ask for crazy prices on gold. Yeah. Stock is, I have no idea. Uh, you can put that one right here. Right. That's everything? Yes. Yeah, okay, cool. No, no. I know you can't return Yeezys and Adidas. I know that. I think now you can't because of the whole um oh, separation. Oh. I think I think I'm pretty sure back in the day you were able to. I know Yeezy supply you weren't able to. Um, but if you got them on Adidas, I'm almost certain you were able to return. You had like 30 days or so. That, that's like more like once or twice. Okay. So what were you looking for um, for your stuff? You say you want to side swap for a 12, and then... You, you, you got these in 12 or no? Uh, let me check for you. I my 50 on this. Uh, maybe 75 each if you get to the Adidas. Uh, I don't know the market on this. Maybe 75 to 100. Uh, 100 because these are used. The pearls, I don't know, man. 
Like I said, I better see them on eBay. Okay. I'll say maybe two, because if they got on um, goat right now, use no box at two. Okay. So, um, shadows. At the shadow? Yeah. Man, I thought I bought this shoe. I thought I bought it low. The shadow low. These are heavily used. Maybe two, I guess. And what about this one, this Air Max? I have no idea about that, bro. Well, okay. I'll say two. If you know what more than me, I know A's an Air Max guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let me see. You're looking for roughly around like seven seventy-five, eight hundred. Yeah. Let me see. Let me see. That's without the fours, right? That's without the fours. Yeah, saw some, yeah. Yeah, the fours. I'm checking right now to see if we have one. It doesn't say we do, but let me just double check. Yeah, it says we have a four and a twelve and a half. No twelve though. Oh, okay. Would you say on the neutral grays again? The neutral grays and the coppers. Um, I think it's like 50 and maybe like um, 75 or whatever. Okay. I only saw one on eBay in the sold listing. It sold for like a buck 20, but that was a bid. Yeah. What's the lowest you want to take on these? Yeah, like 175. Well, let me see the spare, boss. Okay. So for mm -hmm. all of this stuff right here, I'll probably get like 550. Okay. So this one. And then if you want to sell those, I will, you know, I will <laughs> fill your offer oh if you wanted to. What's all from this one? Um, let's see. You want to sell this? Let me see what yeah. they're going for. I got two. I'll probably be a little less. I see they like dipped. I'll probably be around yeah, like two twenty five for them. So you said five fifty? Five fifty for all this, yeah. It'll be seven seventy five with those. If you wanted to do that. <laughs> five fifty. How about the five fifty and um a uh a Westbrook ten U like six? Is there like a um like on eBay? Wait, what, uh, Westbrook what? Westbrook ten? Yeah, yeah. Westbrook ten. Yeah. Oh, what size? Twelve. Can you do five fifty in a Westbrook? They pair that stuff for sixty. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I think that's in that warehouse. You can run and grab uh, that. Yeah. Uh, can you like give me five fifty uh, plus the Westbrook? Five fifty plus the Westbrook. Yeah. So those are goals like six, but we could do five fifty in those. I'll do that. Would you do five twenty five in the Westbrooks? Uh, and uh, three hundred. Okay. okay. Right. Um. Just give us a second. Gotcha. All right. Oh, literally, but they, you just gotta run down the street. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is all the new stuff? Yeah, this okay. is all the new And then this, I don't know if you guys take Funko stuff. How much were you looking for everything? I'm one in the world. You let me know. Any number of mine? Just because it's a lot of shoes. No number at all. You gotta have a number, man. I don't, man. 20, 20, 20 for the shoes, gotta have a. I'm not even in the ballpark. I'm telling you to tell you the truth. Yeah, that's another one. This one, you see me? Just the fat jaw one? Yeah. How much you want for something like this? I don't know, maybe like four or five hundred. You can work, you know, if you guys wanted to throw me a number, you can offer, you know what I'm saying? It's one of the water damage in this. Not the sleeve, just the box. Just the box. The label's still in there, though. Yeah, that's the number. Yeah, This pile, I'll probably not be interested in. Okay. This one, I'll just ask my boss to see what he'll, what he'll say. Okay. Because um, that's more so like kind of like an antique Correct. kind of thing. But again, I can check and see. In the back. And then we owe him 525A. Oh, what's the best way? Oh, hey, hey what's, what's going on now? Nice How are you doing? You, brother. you too, bro. You selling a bunch of stuff? Yeah, trying to. Yeah. We could work sound with like Joe, uh, Fat Joe. He wanted to sell him. He wanted like four for him. Fat Joe. 
Interesting. It's pretty cool. Yeah, man. We had the sale on, on up NYC, and he put it. He put it up on Instagram. I was like the second person online. Damn, yeah, that's sick. It's interesting because it's hard to gauge like what his autograph is worth. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? And only one shoe signed, right? Mm-hmm. Are you negotiable at 400 or is that? A hundred percent. I'm here to work. Yeah. You throw me an offer. Now, he gave these out or you, no, you bought them, them and then he was there. So I think the receipt is in there. I bought two pairs. He signed both of them for me. Oh, really? Yeah, so I'll keep them one. Where are we at roughly on the other stuff? So? I'm at 1050. 1050? That's without this, basically this side plus these three right here. Mm -hmm. uh, what, we're no on this stuff? Yeah. I mean, I'll take whatever. You throw me something, whatever you can offer. Sure. Damn, these are fire, but I know they're cool for shit. I know. This was a, a Nike by me, but I made it as a Chicago. So you, you were at how much? 1050? 1050. That's without this stuff? Yeah. So you're at four here? Throw me a number. Yeah, I got you. Maybe with the other stuff. You can't just take everything, you know, I ain't just saying none of that either. Um, I take pennies for all that, I don't care. I just gotta get rid of it, man. My daughter's about to be born, I need the space. Oh, congrats. Thank you, brother. I'm not trying to go back to anything. <laughs> I couldn't do four on that. Um, I don't know, maybe like 1400 for everything. Can we do a coin flip? 14, <laughs> 14, 14, 75? It's, just, it's fair. That doesn't sound too crazy. I'm bringing yeah. more. I yeah, if you want to do that. Okay, that's a, that's a big coin flip. <laughs> you sure you don't want to meet in the middle somewhere? 14, uh, 1430? Or you want to flip? I mean, I came over here to see you anyway. Oh, right, hey man. <laughs> now, now I hope you win. And then the- Either um, way I won anyway. Come the on. adapts, did you um um deconnect? Yeah, yeah, the, yeah, they're right. off my thing. Not right, bad. They could just reset it anyway under. The yeah, yeah, sometimes people stay connected to it, so like when we sell them, it's kind of like a problem, like adapting and stuff like that. But so 14, that, 1475. Yep. You're calling it in the air. Heads. Damn. I knew you were going to win. <laughs> <laughs> the energy. <laughs> oh, Keep and the quarter, man. Thank you, brother. And about these, you think we could side swap? Oh, you wanted to side swap for the. He wants a ten and a half in the breath force, and then he said a ten and a half or eleven in the power puff. Power puff, I don't know. If we have. Power puff, we definitely don't have the bread force. Is um, we had we had one or mm -hmm. bread force might be tough just because it's our last ten and a half. Um, but let's see what we can do. The power puff, if we don't swap, you want you want to sell them or you want to hold on to these? You don't even got the green pair in that in the ten and a half. I don't think we do, right? Just ten and a half in blue. Nine and pink and uh, pink and green. No, eleven and none of them. Mm mm. Just those three. Literally one of each color. I'll come back. So probably you probably have a ten and a half by then. We might. Hopefully, they've been hard to get, but you know, hopefully we can get one in. Um, you want to call it uh, fourteen fifty and twenty five for the swap. Mm, the price is like 10 bucks difference. I'll pay the 10 if it's, I mean, the difference. I mean, it's not that, it's just like, like I said, like, we have 10s. We, n when you take the 10 and a half, now we have no 10 and a half. So we're all right, all right, so, we'll, so run the 1450 and That's cool. swap. Yeah. yeah, if you're cool with that. For right. sure, for sure. I'm um, a supporter, bro. Yeah, yeah, no, I appreciate it. Um, what's the best way of payment for you? I mean, I prefer cash, yeah, bro. Cash might be difficult, but well, if that's what you, if that, yeah, you need, I don't give wanna... me a second, we could see what we could work Big buyout. I believe he called, I think Berman picked up, and he wanted to make sure we were going to be here because he was a, a fan of the uh, of the YouTube. I didn't get his name, honestly, but shout out to him because he, you know, he brought by some good new, a little bit of good used stuff. These adapts, honestly, I kind of forgot that they even made these. It's been a while since I've seen these, the adapt. Jordan 11. First time seeing that colorway in person. I believe we've had the white pair before. Um, the adapt stuff is just really hard to, uh, to move. I know we just saw one like yesterday, but it is a cool, rare Jordan self lace and all that. Loosen them, tighten them right there. The insole is pretty clean, honestly. It's a size 10 and a half. We got a bunch of new stuff. Like we got some pennies right here, UNC toes, Argons, 312 legacies that they use a lot on um, soul swaps for like Blacksmith 3s and stuff like that. Georgetown, some Jordan Futures. Jordan Futures used to go crazy back in the day. Never had a pair. 
spot. I remember this model used to do numbers. This used to be a really, really good model. This used to sell for some bread, honestly. Like, it was in that era of the NMDs. It's a nasty looking sneaker, I'm not gonna lie, but this shit does, or it did sell back in the day. Got a Georgetown 6, got a Midnight Navy 4, a lot of shit. But the main piece right there, the autograph, Joey Crack, Fat Joe, TS Squad, Air Force. Not gonna sell it, really, really fire. These Air Forces are pretty clean. I like the black pair better than this one. For like, Bromo, probably like that one more, especially with what he's wearing right now, just because he's more into colors than I am. But that's a great sneaker right there. I know Coppola. Con, Pano, all of them had that shoe as like a top three shoe last year. I think that shoe is more about age than it is about the actual design. It was an unreleased shoe. Fat Joe did like a like a sneaker, like tour whatever of one of his houses in I think Miami. And he was going through all his boxes and it was literally just straight Air Forces, just different colorways and all that. And he had like a bunch of those and a bunch of the black pair. So definitely a cool shoe, historical sneaker in my opinion. It speaks about the era. But yeah, again, shout out to that dude. He said he was having a baby, so shout out to him. And then shout out to the other dude that came by he picked up some westbrook's westbrook tens he traded in some stuff too back here you saw the shadows too but this is one of the best ones just because the rarity of them on pearl stuff once you get up in kd model you don't really see them that often i had a hard time looking this shoe up just because there was only like one that sold in this size and there's a few others that sell in different sizes but i like the pearl right there on the side i think that's a dope dope hit if i was in high school i would definitely want these really really bad because like i was really into the um the breast cancer stuff and all red so like something like this in high school i definitely would have won really really badly definitely a fire fire shoe on here i don't know what the names mean obviously his aunt died passed away from breast cancer but all the names right there it's pretty pretty cool in my opinion yeah just got a lot of stuff to click out clean and stuff like that a lot of clothing sitting the ebay finally somewhat caught up with like pictures and listings so like we're not behind the eight ball right now so we're not playing catch up we've been playing catch for like the last two weeks so it feels good to not feel like there's like a weight on your shoulders right now so yeah just gotta clean this stuff up get it posted online get it put on the shelf so yeah catch you guys shortly what a lot of big going on today you know <laughs> oh my god you gotta keep the good shit at the crib oh. what, what you want to say like 50 for both for everything yeah okay <laughs> the only the only thing i had was the armor fives and you know what i'm saying This one's not as bad. Look, go tie dub. You don't even gotta do it. You don't nah, I gotta untie it. You gotta untie it for real? I don't lace like that. I do 180 for everything. So it's like 120 here, 25, 35. Two. That's cool. A lot of work got done today. I guess I could let Jordan wrap it up because he's probably on film more than me. But uh, we did a lot of buying, not as much selling. A lot of eBay stuff, a lot of content stuff. And yeah, we're ready to get out of here. It's Friday night. So Jordan, anything for the people of Jake Berwin? Uh, nothing much for me. Uh, I was over the, at the news site today. It's pretty slow today, but I feel like sometimes there's the calm before the storm. Maybe it'll be, just be really busy tomorrow, but... It's supposed to be raining tomorrow. Oh, all right, lovely. It's supposed to be raining tomorrow. So no, it's not a great start, but we'll see what happens. But yeah, just kind of <laughs> happy you were able to get clothes flicked up that was kind of like bugging me off like the last two weeks but we've just been so busy as you can see this stuff is already filled back up and i could expect it to be even crazier tomorrow with stuff but yeah just really happy that we were able to catch up with all the stuff that we had to get done in the store because again like it was low-key stressing me out so many things to do trying to do everything all at one time on top of dealing with people and buys and stuff like that so to see that we got basically all the you know sneakers and clothing clicked up and you know a good chunk of it put up online it's a good feeling honestly so just working really really hard here for everyone so yeah happy with what the work we've been doing lately and yeah can't wait to tomorrow to end the week when it's done catch you guys tomorrow oh. what's going on today saturday march 2nd really 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 rainy outside today that's either gonna be good or bad for us today. But we got a nice batch of orders going out. First thing I wanna point out, it's not even a sneaker, it's the Supreme hat. That Supreme hat is really, really fire. I love camo. Camo's my favorite pattern, and red's like one of my favorite colors. Just seeing them combine like that is really, really fire. The DJ Khaled vibes, the white pair, we don't really ever see that one often in the store. It doesn't really go for much, but it is to me one of the better ones. You know, it's not as crazy as the other one. The leather is a little bit better. Colorway is a little bit more subtle with that 
that head of purple. You get three laces, you get like a gold, black, purple. Definitely an Easter shoe. We got a smoke pair, a Raptor 7s, but this is a beautiful, beautiful pair. Kind of like seeing them in this condition right now, I'm not gonna lie. Definitely a pair to ball in, but this is like a really beautiful sneaker. Top two Jordan 7s ever in my opinion. This one's really nice. You got another Grinch going out. It's been a while since we saw one, but really nice to see us to sell one again. We got some flu games that we got yesterday. I don't remember if that was caught on film because it was kind of done off the side, but we had a smoke, smoke, smoke pair of flu games from like 03 or something like that. He also sold us those 312s and he also sold us, I like this one more shoe would probably miss. Oh, the igloos. Igloos, so shout out to that guy. Just put them up yesterday. Had an air mouth because it did smell like smoke, but really happy to see that they sold less than 24 hours. These are like the, the Mason de Chateaux, I think it's called. Again, I don't wear mids or anything like that. No hate against them, but it's not my preference, but I think this is a nicely detailed sneaker. You can just see all the patterns going on throughout the shoe. Check is different. Over here is different. It's a nice material. Definitely a cool colorway. Definitely a beautiful fall sneaker right here. This is like a brown, clay, reddish kind of color right here. This is really, really nice. This one goes for a little bit of chicken, honestly, but it's kind of hard to get someone to pay that because it's just like, it's nothing crazy. We got a yellow toe going out. To me, I hate anything colored toe-wise Jordan or Jordan 1-wise, but to me, I think that's one of the best ones, that and the UNC toes. For the price, you can't go wrong with that. I believe they're going for like around retail, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, depending on the size. We got a particle gray nine, got an animal instinct 11. Don't really like that shoe. It is a female sneaker, but I feel like they should have strictly kept it like GS or something like that, just because just seeing that in like the men's size kind of like throws me off. The corduroy SBs, again, I bought I bought a pair here back in the day from A for like 150, maybe even less. And now that shoe's gone for like a stupid, stupid, ridiculous price. So every time I see that shoe, that's what I think of, just like one of my many transactions with A. So shout out to the person who bought that one. Digital camo air forces. Those are low key, low, 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 like the lowest keys, like fire. If it was like a little bit, like if it was like whiter and less gray, I would like that shoe a little bit more. But yeah, that digital camo, the dark gray just kind of throws me off a little bit. The vintage starter snapback is fire. The CPF fans, I know Berwin has the other pair, the green pair. Not gonna lie, they are growing on me, but I don't think I could buy them. But it is a wild sneaker. I like seeing something different with Nike, just experiment with something different. I'm kind of tired of seeing the same thing replayed over and over and over again. So really good shoe, goes for a pretty price. Thought that shoe was gonna go down, but you know, it did the opposite. It kind of like shot up. 700 salt, got some Griffies. Another pair we got yesterday, actually, the Wheat 13. <clears throat> and then the Washington Redskins, now the Commanders. Starter jacket, love the starter jackets, you know, the old school stuff. I think the NFL should bring that stuff back because I think the coaches swag with the pullovers and zip ups were just really, really fine with the snapbacks. Like, I just love seeing those pictures, honestly. Just one of my favorites. So, man, shout out to everyone. Bought something. Let's hear from the guys to see what they got to say about this stuff. Definitely raining out today. We'll see what happens with that. Not a fun drive. In terms of the orders, I was looking stuff over as Jordan was talking. And this is this is definitely like a funky bunch of orders. Like, everything is just kind of unique. I think those mids are hitting like, you know, $350, $400. Kind of crazy. I mean, I haven't really held them, looked at the quality or anything. But, I mean, if you just asked me just straight up, I would say, I don't think any mid is worth that, honestly. But those specifically, I would be like, nah, probably not. Raptors, gotta agree with Jordan. Definitely, uh, I would say probably my favorite Jordan 7. I mean, you just can't go wrong with them. And then the flu game pointed out a couple shoes that that guy sold us yesterday. And they moved really quickly. But if you had asked me what shoe out of that pile, you know, like, was it the four that he had sold us? Which one was going to sell the quickest just based on all the condition of all of them? I would definitely say the flu games. There's some shoes that no matter what the, what the condition is, um, you know, because those are 03 and they're smoked. No matter what the condition is, some shoes will just always sell no matter what. I think that's a good example of one. You know, they've released you know a couple different times now and it's just a classic and i think people will buy it no matter how beat up it is and that's the case with that it moved in less than 24 hours so nothing else away from me what's burn up to say yeah i'm gonna start with the cpfms it is a crazy looking sneaker every time i wear it everyone just looks directly at them honestly can't help it because they're just absolutely big and chunky so and they're surprisingly comfortable for anyone out there that wants to buy them i did go a whole size down i'm normally like an eight eight and a half i went down to a seven and they look like straight tires so that's pretty funny the quarter is SBs. I always mention it every time, but I had the chance to grab those for retail. Before Nike SBs were like hot, they were just sitting on the Nike website. And then the next week, they just started selling out. So a little regret there, but nonetheless, still a great SB. I feel like if they made those Mason Chateaus a high, those would definitely sell better. But since they're a mid, I feel like they don't get enough love. I love the little details and the quality on that one. And the price that they sold for is pretty crazy. So shout out to whoever bought that one. Raptor 7, like the guy said, another great OG sneaker. I hope they re-retro those like the right way i hope the quality and the shape of them comes out great kobe grinches you guys already know what we do with those and i'm really glad to see that the shoes that we just pictured and listed yesterday are already selling i woke up this morning and i saw all the sold listings from yesterday and it was kind of funny because
because I didn't realize those are going to sell that fast, especially those food games. And those 312s, those are absolutely um, horrible. And I just want to say, Timberland laces on the wheats don't look as bad as I thought. Kind of see what he was trying to do, but uh, they don't look terrible. So <laughs> shout out to the guy who sold that one. But yeah, I just want to mention one more thing. Jake did point out something really, really important that I kind of forgot about. He said, like, the food games always sell, like, no matter what. And it's funny because that's an older pair. Like I said, I think that's like an other three. I don't um, call me on that. I forgot exactly what year it was, but literally just so like yesterday or two days ago. I think yesterday it was. So two back to back. So definitely one of those OG J's that's just like, it's really up there. It's kind of hard to put all the OGs because it's like, to me, like they're all just so great in their own way. Then they all could be top three. Kind of crazy to say, but flu games for sure. That was kind of crazy to see. We, we sold them two back to back. A really cooked pair and a really pretty clean pair. So yeah, definitely a great shoe. But yeah, it is Saturday. It is raining. I hope today is a little slow, but I feel like when I say that and whenever it's raining for some reason, like everyone wants to come out and drive in the rain and sell this stuff today. So probably expecting a busy day. Yeah, the guys got a lot of good feet on. Jay got some traps. Burn got the Island Money Air 5s. Bacon. Mm. I'm guessing Ace probably gonna wear an Air Max 90 Gore-Tex because it's raining and he's been wearing those pretty consistently lately. Probably gonna beat them up. So good Saturday. Let's pack this stuff up and get it out. Did you want to trade them for something that you saw? Nah. Sell them? Yeah. Just these? No, these two. Okay, how much you want for both of them? Anything in mind? No, it's making an over. We'll buy those. Let me see what those will look like. That's a 2019 pair. Here you go. Jordan. Hi, my man. Thanks. How's it going? How's it going, man? You got the new ones? Hmm? You got the new ones? No. I was going to say, I thought, you, I thought you got the new ones. That's why you just getting rid of these. Mm -hmm. You don't have no number in mind for this? I don't know. <laughs> I was just bored today. I was cleaning up the closet. And I was like, so today. I came here really to sell these two because I saw like a week or two ago you had a pair. I'd be like two fifty for the two. Both? Yeah. <laughs> What's your price then? How much are you going to get for one hundred twenty-five dollars for this? One hundred fifty. What's your price? At least 200 and I got the so, box so see and I got the a, box so you had a price yeah but yeah. I wanted to see what you're gonna do I, I mean I can't I can't 200 and I got the I, original I, box I mean I gotta feel the temperature I gotta see where you're at so you had 200 yeah you got the box with you yeah it's in the car okay now we're talking I know how it goes you guys yeah. be like oh the box $50 no no <laughs> well you say now you have, now you say you have the box you know it changes it like slightly but um would you do a buck 75 no, just let me see. What about these? These? I got a hundred. They're brand new too. I can do with twenty. Can I see can I see the box? Yeah. This one please? It's in the car. Okay. Right. We're gonna sell a trade. Just uh either or. Okay. See what cool. I can get for these. How are you guys? You good have it yourself. Good. It's a little wet from uh carrying it inside. No, you good. I like the pay you have one. Oh thanks man. Are you trying to sell a trade? Uh, I don't know if I asked you that question. Yeah, I, I, I'm down for either. It's just like I want to see what I could get and then if there's anything that I probably want here. Is that for me, Yeah. I have a couple of Kobe's that don't have like boxes that could be used. That I bought from you guys, I didn't even wear it once. Okay. <laughs> you throw these up here too? Or? So, I probably like to be at like three for both. So I'll value these at one. I'll value the threes at uh, one. I'll value these at 175 or 125, something like that, or two. 
one, I think it was. But yeah. Just because I just see what he's selling for in this type of condition, plus the new one drops, so uh, that's fine. So three, sir? Cash, though, right? If you want cash. Yeah, cash. Cash? All right, but you want this box to play along? Yeah. All right, all right, all right. There you go. Um, yes, sir. Have a good week, guys. Okay. How much do you want for your stuff? I feel like I asked you that question already, but. Um, short term memory. Where do you want to start? I was anyway. hoping we could go maybe like. Would you do like 200 for all the Kobe's? Like the three Kobe's? Okay. I'll, I'll check into that. I'll probably do those last just because they're the okay. boss. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, I mean, uh. Thing on the other stuff. Uh, okay. Could you do like I wore these like once, I think. Mm -hmm. Like ninety bucks. Ninety bucks. Okay. Let me see. So these, I think I bought from you guys for like two seventy, maybe like two ten. It's been slow today. Mm -hmm. So the weather? It's starting to pick up now. Surprisingly, nice. it's usually pretty busy. Towards closing? Nah, it's just, just rainy days. It's just, it's, oh, really? It's just always <laughs> busy for us. But for Good. some reason, today's, I mean, I'm not complaining, honestly. Yeah, yeah. Days, <laughs> we're catching back up with some of the stuff that we get done, but it's probably going to pick up like around like three, though. Like, yeah. I just know how like, this stuff goes for <laughs> us. What, what you want for the, um, the actions? Um, like two. Okay. Size nine, right? Yep. Two? These? Yeah. Um like one thirty? One twenty five ish remember. And then this I'll take like fifty bucks. Fifty bucks. Okay. You said two hundred for all the colors, right? Yeah. I think this one goes for a lot new, but obviously this one's pretty uh used. I believe I was at 580 for everything. For everything? Yeah, let me just double check. Yeah, 580, I was at for everything. Do you have a breakdown? Uh, yeah, it was. So you said you wanted two for the Kobe's. Mm -hmm. I think I was around like 130 or 40 for the Kobe's. These, I was, I was like around like 30 bucks here. Um, I was around 150 here, like 70 here, like 30 here. Just like the GR pairs, I yeah. shoot for nothing. I think these are around like 150. Mm. So it's not 580. I can do more store credit if you wanted something else. Mm. Or, or whatever you think, let me know. I might hold on to these. Okay. What'd you say here? Uh, 150. 150? Mm hmm. Should you do 180? What about these? These um, two are the, the real, yeah. These two are the real cookers in the, yeah. <laughs> in the, in the batch. Um, cause again, I could work with you. Just yeah, let me just because I got these for two seventy, and I these didn't want to lose too much. Yeah, I know I they, 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 yeah. they dip, you know. So like, obviously we're selling yeah. for less than what you pay for. Yeah. Um, mm. What'd know. you say in the Kobe's? Um, I think for the batch it was like around like one thirty, one forty, like something like that. Did you do one sixty on these? Oh, no, I'll give you these for thirty. We'll that. Mm -hmm. Um. What'd you say on these? You said 30? Like around 30. I think it was like 35. It might have been like... Could you do 50 on it? Yeah, you're good. More than like once. I know. It's just a GR New Balance. Yeah. It's like we throw them out on that table, on the, like the cheap yeah. table basically for under 100. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll put it to the side. What'd you say on these? 70 there. Like where? 70 bucks. Oh, you're close. Yeah, I'll um, keep these. What's the best That's you want to do on these? You said 120. I was thinking like 100. Okay, so you want 100 there. Yeah. Um, you said 180 here. Uh, I can meet you at 625 for everything. What's that? Yeah, um, no, no, no. We're on the same, we're on the same side as the board member. Is that like, it's like an extra 45? Because yeah, I, I think I want to be on like, maybe like 180. I wouldn't take things I said. Sorry, folks. If you took those out. Yeah. We'll be at 4.30. Like, everyone knows perfect, right? So they should like start a match. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Did you do 6.50 for everything? Yeah, I think 6.25 might be my best. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take this one. 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 Yeah, I'
What do you got with now these? Uh, well, they just got back over. I was 430. Because it's 580. Yeah, yeah. So I said 150 here. Would you just do 640? Call it a day? Probably 625. So I don't know if it was yeah, a mistake. Yeah, screw it. Cool. Um, what's the best way for you? Venmo. Venmo? Yeah, Venmo's fine. Okay. Can I see your Venmo, please? Yeah. And this is everything? Yeah, this okay, is everything. Cool. I, I know on the phone you said you had like 20 pairs. I have I have more at home. I oh, just okay, okay, I got you. These are the ones that I would just want to get, get rid of. Okay. And then I assume the frags are the one you talked about because I saw the box inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, most places in, in Brooklyn that's like this, mm -hmm. it smells like weed and you know, some <laughs> plant, so you get uncomfortable when you walk in there, you know? Right, right. Well, yeah. I, you know, yeah. it's not bad here. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, those are brand new. I bought those when they first came out. Yes. And these for now, depending on how my experience goes, I'll bring you guys more. Okay. Yeah. Uh, sure, for sure. Yeah, those honestly, when I was able to make some money on my own, a lot of people uh, my first pair. A lot yeah. of people wanted these back in the day. Yeah. They don't like, they don't wear them much anymore, the phone posits, but it's funny because yeah. they're like they're releasing like a lot of those pairs. Yeah, I think I think uh, a pair of just a pair of just came out. Eggplants? Yeah, eggplants that did the anthracites. For like well, those ones. One twenty. Yeah. And you guys got <laughs> it at one seventy five. Buy a lot of your pairs from Goat. Yeah, I did. Yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, <laughs> it's only like maybe two pairs there that I bought retail. Part of the game now. I know, but you know it's bad. It's bad time right now. No, no, I hear you, bro. I hear you. But I mean, at least the market is down right now. That's mm -hmm. like the good part about it. Is that like everything's just so low that you don't really gotta worry about it being as crazy as it was before. Like before, yeah. yeah. And how much were you thinking for everything without these? You said you guys spoke about that one already. Separate, yeah. Separate. Um, what were you looking for? Everything else. I don't know how you had it um, broken down. Um, I, when, when I, in, in excluding these two, I believe, yes, uh -huh. excluding these two and this gray one right here, okay. I was asking for, um, 180 for these, 180 for and those. I was just only asking for about a hundred for these, Okay. and for these, I'll, I'll take like, um, like 110, 105 for these, okay. and, um, these right here, I know I was asking for four. But he said that his price is gonna be off. How much you said for these? Four. Yeah, that's gonna be way off. Like the used market now is like. So what do you what do you think? Let me see. Let me let me look into those. Sure. Um, did you want a bulk price or you want an individual price? I don't know. It's hard. Um, you know, whichever one is gonna make me walk out of here happy. You know. No, it's just up to you. Yeah. Cause sometimes like I'll do a bulk price and people ask for like a breakdown. Um, and I gotta try to remember like what I pay for, or what I price anything at. So right, right. I didn't know if there were certain shoes like you were a little bit attached to that you want to. The only ones I'm on. really attached to is these, man. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I'm not. You know, you're 100. So mm -hmm. as, as you can see, I got the, I got the lows. No, nah, it's a rare pair. Yeah, you know? I really, I really like, I really uh, like them. But Jordan, most right. of the one I'm attached to is this one. Okay. Yeah. I was actually at a other at another store, mm -hmm. and the guy kept, you know, giving me. He, well, he was actually saying no to certain pairs, and I was surprised. Yeah. Um, and then a gentleman that was also selling a few, he told me about you guys. He was like, look, check out. Where is this at, New York? Yeah, they, was like, yeah, they have a YouTube channel. So, I said, all right, I'll take a look. And your eBay prices are pretty fair, too. When I was looking at it, I said, yo. We do better. Yeah, we yeah. do better in stores. So, like, if you saw something online for, like, let's say, like, 800, and we've had it for a while, like, we'll probably take, like, 700. Or, like, if you see something online for, like, 250, we'll take, like, 220. Like, we do better um, off eBay. Yeah. Um, even if you send us offers on eBay, we still try to do better anyways. So, for this stuff without the frags, mm -hmm. I'm at 950. Can you make it even 1,000? Okay. Let me see. Mm -hmm. So, you, you know, uh, let's leave it at 950. Let's see what we can do with this. I'm because I'm I'm, I'm I'm there with that number to a thousand. Okay. And so. hey, he said he spoke to you in the DMs about yeah. these. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, what was the price that was given to you? It was fifteen. I was, uh, you know, I was looking for a little, uh, uh, just a little more. You know, I got, I did spend well, over resale for it, of course. Yeah, I hear you. It's a hard shoe for us to sell. We still got eight and a half. It, like, we never. Oh, it's hard to sell. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I mean. Oh. Cause I, I, I'm guessing a lot of people aren't really willing to spend the kind of money. That's right the now, thing. Right? Yeah, it's just one of those things. I am kind of attached to them. I, am, I really do. I have most of the Travis Scott ones, but I like the lows a lot more. Yeah. How you doing? How you doing? What were you looking for? I mean, I know what you're looking for, but here in our 15, I mean, what, what are you thinking? No, pretty much like what, what's the best, you, you know, just to make me feel a little better about letting them go. What's gotcha. the best you guys could do for those? It, was the other stuff good or? We'll be yeah, off on the other stuff too. Uh, we're basically good on the other stuff. He said he wants to see with this guy. Gotcha. Uh, what'd you get originally? Like gold or Fight Club or something? Go. 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 Most, of the, most of these are from Go. Gotcha. I'd assume you could probably come up 100, but uh, just a tough shoe for us to move, you know what I mean? It might be worth like letting them sit on one of the apps till they sell. I, I don't think I'm ever going to wear them. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's, it's it's one of those. It's not shoes. it's not a shoe that you really want to just like these. You can pull it off. It's fine. It's low yeah, key. A lot of people like the lows better. Yeah, it's, even it's though it's the like high these are like more like they stand out more. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, they stand out a little bit more. Top shelf. Dude, I'm thinking about it so hard right now. That's, <laughs> a, that's the reason why I didn't want to look at them. You know, <laughs> have them in your hand, you don't really want to. Nah, trust me. I hear you, man. I hear you. Um, twenty six for everything. Um. Other 26 with the hats. How many of how many hats are? Four hats. The hats we sell low, honestly. Like we had those just sitting for a while. We don't really sell hats like how they do in like other stores. Um, yeah, I would want 26 with the with the hats. The other one probably. What does that come up to? All right. All right. Want to do that? Yeah. All right. But and uh. Yeah, like Venmo, Zell, Apple Pay. Zell. Okay, cool. We can sell you more unless you need a check or something like that. Alright, so let's do it. Alright, How much do you want for the pandas? Uh, for 12, I think I was like at 70. How are you doing, man? The 7 double. The smaller sizes were like 80. I don't know if that's cool beans. I kind of want to pay out. I'm going to go on. I know they're like. Where'd that come from? Cause I think the the GS and then the the women are going for like the same about. <laughs> what do you want for the for the twelve again? My fault. Like seventy? That's like ten less. Okay. It's not terrible. I got like sixty across the board. That's fine. If you take all of them. Yeah. The five. So three hundred. Um, I'll do one eighty on those. That's cool too. So. Uh, 120. That's cool. Um, what do you want for those? Oh, what do you want for those? 270. Uh, 260. Yeah, is that in the middle? <laughs> That's the middle. 65. I'm 270. You're at 260. It did go down a little bit. So we're not 260 then. We can meet in the middle. 265. <laughs> Oh, 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 for, for that, for that, for that, uh, 10? For that 10? Or 5? To what? 260, 270 or 265? 260, 265. That's fine. Heads, tails, corner, air? Yeah. Heads. Oh, that's good. That was a good Man, that's a great toss that was for me. Good that's a good oh my toss god. god. That's a great toss for me. I'm not gonna lie. That, that was a. That was a great toss for me. I, I appreciate like, that. That was my best foot ever. I oh my that. god. God, so I owe you. 385. Oh, the, what? What do oh. you want on these? Whoa, what, what are you gonna? What does he want? No, I don't even know what these are. <laughs> I, mean, I, I know the ALDs, but I might pass on them just because like we can't even move a 550. I can respect that. <laughs> like we can't move a 550 to save our life. They're going for like 130. Yeah. One like one 130, 115, 148, 120. I'll pay like 60 for them. <laughs> like, I don't want them to cook me, so it's fine. Uh. So I owe you 385, right? 
265 plus 120. Yeah. All right, yeah. Which one did I bring? Size 11, Size 11 12. 11, yeah. I mainly want to see if I can offload this, but this will go to, click this one first actually, because I wanted to wrap. This looks a little weird to me, because I have Why? six pairs. It's not at, like the cracking's not as pronounced. Does that make sense? I mean, it happens. They probably all look a little different. But aside from that, they look under. Everything looks good, the paper. Uh, do you want to talk about this stuff first then? Like if this is your main goal to see if you can get rid of this I'm stuff? I'm looking to get rid of this stuff too. Okay, gotcha. Okay. So, 377 is big. 350. Okay, possible. Were these, what, what do you, the dude was wanting? What size is that? 11 and a half. Oh my, no, it's the white one, but he wants that one too. Gotcha. For the, the dunks. Uh, let's see, 170. Okay. I mean, we can start at 200. And I'm trying to get realistic. How you doing? What's up, bro? Hey, what's going on? Know, I'm kind of hesitant because I have a an offer on these for bid. I don't know if you'd be there. What's bid? Let's see. When I talked to the guy, it was 290, but it was at 295, so it would be at 290. This is a mixture of old stuff, new, random. Yeah. Those are Terminators from. 2009 golf. I saw you were looking for a youth size, so these are used. These are used, right? <coughs> yeah, these are used. These 40 bucks. Those 50. Um, the other shoes we just got in, but they would be priced if you want. Okay. I feel like these two we probably passed on. You know when you post stuff on eBay and you get offers right away? Yeah. Well, somebody offered me 200 bucks and I posted these like a year ago. I didn't take it, I and now they've just yet. sat on one of on them? the New Balance. Wow. Yeah. The on golfers, anything on here? These are um, the pearls. 70 bucks? Yeah. Uh, I guess 60. 60? Hold that. These two, you said how much? 50 or 40. I like 30 and 30. I don't know if that's worth it. This one last sale was like around 45 50 Damn, really? Yeah. yeah. Because I found them for 150 To be fair, I paid $50 for them, so that's fine. Price of mine for these? I feel like stuff like this is pretty low. Well yeah. yeah. Sure, they might be in the same ballpark as these two, honestly. It's brand new, they're like 90 You 40 I got, I met you on 30 on both of them. Well, let's see here. So you're stuck at what here? A 290. I, otherwise, I'd just pass because I can ship it. Gotcha. I think I guess we'll pass on these. I would love to buy them. Just 290 is a little high. <coughs> where, where, I mean, where are you at? Because I have to pay $10 for shipping. 270. Can't come up. What's the other one? 280. Well, yes, yes. Because yeah. these were at like 350 the other day. Which is I know. I should be wild. Dude. These we want to talk about. I feel like I'd be at, um, you said 170. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'd be at 150 on them. Yeah, it's 163. Um, oh, it is? Yeah. You do 160? If we do 160 here, and I do the 280 here, if we do 340 here. No, I wouldn't do that low on that. Okay. Yeah. So you might want to hold them. They're kind of low. Yeah, I tried to hold them. I thought they were at least 450, honestly. Yeah, like in the So, what did we say you do here? Well, I tried to group it in with this. Yeah, I know, I know. But, um, yeah, probably at 150 cash here. Uh, 225, yeah. You say you can't do 160? I don't want to be at 150. Oh, I'm honestly. I mean, I'm either at 160, otherwise I'm just... Oh, man. It's good. Hmm? No. No. Uh, I hit those on sneakers. I had the yeah, no worries. Um, you wanted to sell this other stuff, or we do the price for these, right? Thirty each year. Yeah, thirty, thirty, thirty. So sixty here. Yep. I pulled those. Okay. So that's one fifty. Did you decide here? Yeah. I mean, I guess I'll take both of these. Actually, where do you, what, what number do you come out to? Close to five ninety. Yeah, that's cool. Um, question. Yeah. Credit. You do, uh, do a little more, or? Honestly, I, I feel like I've... On these came, two? Like, on yeah, these two? you didn't really give me much room. No, I, uh, I understand. But, like, if there's something you were looking for, so it's more, obviously, you'd rather, rather uh, trade than sell, you know? The USB lasers. Leather and a half. Crimson. 
Yeah, check them out. Um, if you're interested, I mean, let me know what you're thinking. We can see what we can do. Um, where do you get the on these? Are? No, I mean, you I tell me. Want. What do you think is fair? What about these? Where are you at? Because I saw them online, and they had a stand online that was pretty. It looked pretty significant, but now I'm looking at it and I don't really see it as bad. Okay. Um, what size is that one? Eleven and a half. I mean, same type of thing. We had them up for eight twenty-five, but you trying to tell me what you're thinking. I mean, I need to know base price to start. Right? I'm not going to bid against myself. I mean, that's what you're telling me to do. But no, I'm not. I give you. I, 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 this is my price. Eight twenty-five. 825. Tell me what you want to pay for them. Gotcha. gotcha. You know, I'm not trying to beat you up. You beat me up a little. I'm not trying to beat you up. I, mean, I could say eight hundred, but then you could say seven. Like, I don't really know what you value them at. Gotcha. Okay. Cool. I could grab the other one too if you want to see them both. Yeah. Because they are used. So. Oh, this this is maybe the one with the stain because there is a mark. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Um, I think I'll pass on these. Pass right now. Yeah. Um, and then if there's a price in, in mind for these, even as used, let me know. But if you were trying to get them brand new, I understand too. It's like a weird. Uh, I'm gonna wear it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. But I, you know, I I say I'm gonna pay. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah let me know. Two fifty. Two fifty. I mean, I don't know where you're at. Probably. 340. It's the type of thing we also just kind of got them. I do see they're super rare, brand new, but I know that it's probably a difficult shoe to move, you know? Um, 3190 on top. Probably meet you at 325. Make 100 off. Just take the 5 off. I'll, I'll do the 320. Two, what's that, 270 cash? I really want those. On top? Yeah, I mean, that's cool. Yeah. Just check them out, make sure. No, I'm, I'm just fine. So. Yeah. Yeah, I like those a lot. I know they're super rare. Who back? Probably didn't see me today. That's okay. Got a lot of work done. Shout out to everyone who pulled up today. It was super rainy, super ugly outside, and it's the type of day where you're like, oh, no one's going to come to a sneaker store. But that was the total opposite of what I felt like happened today. We did a lot of buying, a lot of selling, a lot of trading. We got some awesome stuff in, as you can see on this counter. Cold Wall Air Max Plus, which I've never seen before until I saw those. We got the Blue Moons. We got the other Baklavas next to some protection packs. Reimagine 3s, of course, fan favorites. The Adapt 11s, something you don't see often. Original 2019. Teen bread fours. We got some different Air Maxes, some other stuff, and then we got this awesome pair that was donated. Shouts to RB for pulling up and dropping these off. Very cool OGs that uh, I was just talking about. How we need to reimagine these, and then he brings in a pair. And like, how good would this shoe look if it like looked like somewhat like this, just like really good materials and stuff? This is an amazing one right here. I would try to wear them, but I know that's a no go. But uh, awesome donation, Jake Berwin, Jordan. Anything for the people about today or the weekend or anything? Like I was saying didn't think it was gonna be that busy today and then it ended up being pretty consistently busy you know i was here in the old store or old store cheese like i'm repeating what these people are saying it's here uh in the used side today mostly it's nice you know i've been here for it'll be coming up on three months already uh, you know in mid march which is kind of crazy but i've enjoyed it but that being said it's been nice you know it seems like more people come in on the uh the used side more sort of to sell but uh, i was here for a lot of the day just getting used to you know legit checking some stuff when it comes in you know seeing where i'd be at i'm pricing some stuff out seeing where i'd be at when people come in to sell so it's just nice to get in the groove of things i don't mind sitting around and you know pricing stuff out when no one's in here but i think it's always good to, have, to be busy just to be busy first of all but it's just nice to be busy because it helps the time go by a lot faster i just want to shout out to the kid that just came in bought some shoes off us uh, said he uses christmas money so i know christmas money especially around that age is valuable you should just spend it on anything and everything so shout out to him and his mom for coming for pulling up copping some kicks yeah so shout out to everyone who's been pulling up copying some kicks we've been selling a lot of stuff on ebay a lot of stuff in store so hectic day but a great day we'll see what happens next week i've been trying to tell myself that we're going to start buying in the new side and we're going to start filming there but uh i keep pump faking on it so maybe next week i won't pump fake on it and we'll do some buying in the new section but uh either way shots all y'all and uh to the one and done oh. all right been a little while <laughs> I've, had, I've had two shots now. <laughs> two shots now first one was all right second one was awful i guess that means uh third third time's the charm here see you tuesday yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, <laughs> it looked so good. <laughs>